I think you all glory and praise and honor to the most high. Uh, and we're gonna we're gonna get into it today, man. You know, I've been I've been meaning to do this one for a while, but I kept po po postponing it, man. And uh you know the topic is gonna be Noah was not a Caucasian man. <laughs> now as you can see in the video. You know, it, it told you that, you know, two Caucasians can't create color. And Noah, he had sons that was, you know, high, of high pigmentation. For example, Ham. Ham was the blackest one, you know. So he couldn't have been a Caucasian man, you know. And Shem was also black. And Japheth was also black, too. But he, like Japheth may have been of a lighter hue. But he was still black, you know. Now, let's go to the book of Enoch. You know, because a lot of um, evangelicals, especially the, the white evangelical Christians, when they read this, they love to say that, uh, or when they read this, they think that he was a white man, which is not true. So Enoch 105, 1 through 3. After a time, my son, my son Methuselah took a wife for his son Lamech. She became pregnant by him and brought forth a child, the flesh of which was white as snow and red as a rose, the hair of whose head was white like wool and long, and whose eyes were beautiful. When he opened them, he illuminated all the house like the sun. The whole house was abounding with light, and when he was taken from the hand of the midwife, opening also his mouth, he spoke to the Most High of Righteousness. Then Lamech, his father, was afraid of him, and flying away, came to his own father Methuselah, and said, I have begotten a son unlike to other children he is not human <laughs> but resembling the offspring of the angels of heaven is of a different nature from ours being altogether unlike to us all right so let's stop right there that's the end pretty much so why was lamech afraid of him number one it could only be a couple things Nobody on the earth looked like that. They weren't used to people on the earth looking like that. You know what I mean? Because if he was, if they, if he, if he was used to seeing some uh, you know, people that look like babies that came out look like that, he wouldn't, he wouldn't trip. Or number two, they were living in the time where the fallen angels were on the earth, and they knew what the fallen angels looked like. This is why he was afraid, and they knew that the fallen angels was having kids with um with the with the, with the woman of uh, on on the earth, and what the and and, when, and what those kids came out like. Now, if you watch my uh, the previous videos, um, the origins of the white race. Uh, you know, we talked about how when the angels fell, they lost their pigmentations. You know, they were black; they all were all black, and when they lost their pigmentation, they turned white. You know, so this is the only two reasons that he would be afraid of him, of, 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 of his son. That when, when he came out looking like that, you know, now these topics are look like I always say these topics are look controversial, man. But I'm just bringing out the truth. He says right there, I unline it. Lam then Lamech was afraid of him and he went he went to his, uh, his father Methuselah for answers, you know. Cause he maybe he maybe he taught that his woman was laid with the fallen. Maybe maybe he taught that, you know. So oh, man, so he says, bad. He's begotten some unlike to 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 other children. He's not human. But what did he say? He's re he, 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 he's resembling the offspring of the angels of heaven. Now you have to understand, you know. You know. When I when I when I used to read this, I used to think like, damn, you know the angel, you know the angel, the angels, you know, they 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 they, they, they were, maybe he's talking about the brightness of the light around the angels. This and sir, no, the fallen lost their pigmentation, man. This is this is what this is what this is this is why he was afraid, you know. And if you watch that 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 that, that um that video that I did. I think it's titled "Ungodly Woman Caused the Watchers to Fall," and that video it shows you that look the 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 woman knew who the watchers were, you know back then, you know the people back then knew who the watchers were, they were easily identified, 
You know, it was it was no it was no hiding from them. Uh -huh. Oh man. <laughs> uh no. I came across this movie, man. Um Noah and it was when I was, you know, looking up things about Tubal Cain and this movie, this 2014 movie Noah kept popping up. So I was like, why the, why the hell did, you know, the movie keep popping up? So I finally, you know, you know, looked into it and it come to find out, you know, Tubal Cain was in this movie. So I was like, all right, this is interesting, you know, you know, because I wasn't even, <laughs> I, 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 I wasn't even like thinking of nothing about this movie, man. You know, I never seen it before, but I started watching clips about it, clips about it, you know, and two ball cane is in it. But this movie is out of order, man. <laughs> you know, it was completely out of order. You know, in it, you got Ham. He, they, they have him depicted as a white man when we know Ham was the blackest one. They had Methuselah in there helping out the fallen angels, which never happened in the scriptures. They had nowhere in there being friends with the fallen angels, you know, which never happened in the scriptures. They had Methuselah died in the flood. Never happened. You know, like, Methuselah was righteous, man. How how would he have died in the flood? Like, he would have been on the ark, you know? So, it was like, whoever made this, man, is blasphemous, man. The most I got something special coming for you, man. You know, they had the, um, they had the fallen angels, you know, they they showed the fallen angels being forgiven for the for, for the things that they did and being taken back up into heaven, which never happened, because in Enoch it tells you that, you know, they petitioned the Enoch, you know, for forgiveness, and Enoch told him like the Mosa said, no, you guys are not gonna be forgiven, um, you know, they 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 had a ham killing two ball cane, you know, which is which is incorrect, you know, um. You know, we know Tubal Cain died from the hands of Lamech on the wicked side of Cain, you know, from the wicked side of Cain's lineage, you know. So a, a lot of things was just off with this movie, man, from just from the from just from the clips that I was watching, man. You know, I watched enough clips. I don't even have to watch the whole movie to know, like, look, this is this is off, man. This, this movie was way off, man. You know, but there's certain things that you could take from it, you know. Now, remember... When I did that uh, that video, and it says the fallen angels, the uh, the transformers represents the fallen angels. The transformers represent the fallen angels, and we're gonna take a look at a clip right now. And it's well, let's take a look at it first. And it's, it's no one interacting with two ball cane, which is something else that happens in the movie. In the movie, this all belongs to me. This land, this forest. That stronghold of yours. Did you really think you could protect yourself from me in that? It's not protection from you. Then what is it? An ark. To hold the innocent when the Creator sends his deluge to wipe out the wicked from this world. The Creator does not care what happens in this world. Nobody has heard from him since he marked Cain. We are alone, orphan children, cursed to struggle by the sweat of our brow to survive. Damned if I don't do everything it takes to do just that. Damned if I don't take what I want. We have met. I am the son of Lamech. Eight generations descended from Seth. Return to your cities of Cain. No, we have all been judged. I have men at my back, and you stand alone and defy me. I'm not alone.
these minions, uh, they're with you. So you see in this scene, you had this interaction between Noah and Tubal Cain. The, the, the guy he was talking to was Tubal Cain. And the creatures that popped up behind Noah, those are, you know, the fallen angels. And I remember it, in the book of Enoch, it tells you that the fallen, some of the fallen angels, you know, they were, they were cast into, uh, you, you know, uh, I think it was, I think Sheol or D uh, Dudel, the desert of Dudel. And they had like rocks around them, you know, they would place them in rocks. That's why they have rocks around them and stuff like that. That's what it says in Enoch, you know, but remember in, when, when I, uh, I did that video, said that, that video that said, um, the the transformers represents the fallen angels remember what optimus prime said he said look we always been here hiding in plain sight among you now you see that in in this clip right here you know that the, the the fallen angels was right there you know hiding in plain sight and they didn't know you know so that's what that's something that i took from this movie and and you and 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 and, and it makes kind of sense why they had the fallen angels helping Noah build the ark and stuff like that. Why? Because these guys bow to the fallen angels, man. They bow to the fallen angels. So they're going to depict them as the good guys. Like I told you in the Transformers video, you know, they, 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 have, the, they have the Transformers who are really the fallen angels behaving like the good guys. And in this video right here, this Noah, they, 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 they had the fallen angels... And you know it was kind of like like they were showing sympathy towards them, like they were like they were they were like what they did wasn't so bad, you know. <laughs> and it, like I said, if these guys are bowing to the fallen angels, of course they're gonna be like, look, yo, show us in a good light, you know. Make a movie about us, you know, showing us in a good light, man, you know. Tell our version of what happened. <laughs> but yo, none of this stuff never happened. Like I said, man, in this movie, these guys went back up to heaven. Like yo, this this never happened, man. You know? Oh man, this, this movie is outrageous, man. You know the the watches was helping Noah fight the enemy. Like why would the Most High use the watches to help Noah fight the enemy when he could just use his righteous angels, man? You know he got he has righteous angels. Uh uh uh. You know, uh, oh, millions, hundreds of thousands. How how much ever. You know, to help him out. But they, in the movie, they were showing you that Noah <laughs> was he went he 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 was helping um he he went to the fallen angels for help, and the fallen angels was helping him. He asked them for help, which is outrageous, man. But but this is really what they're showing. They're showing you that look, we're in league with them, man. This is what they're showing you in the movie. You know, this movie's out of order, man. You know. Now we're going to take a, a look at one more clip. Now, and this clip is going to be with Tubal Cain. This is how they depicted him in this movie. Now, remember, the, the Freemasons walk in the footsteps of Cain. And Tubal Cain is a descendant of, uh, of Cain, you know, from, from that legend. But look at, how the, this, look at how they depicted him in this movie. You know? <laughs> I am a man made in your image. Why will you not converse with me? Men united are invincible! 
Do you want to live? We kill the giants. We kill Noah. We take the Ark. Look, clip of him and his family with the fallen. But look, look, look at how they depicted him. Somebody that the Most High wasn't even talking to. You know, he, he wanted to communicate with the Most High, but the Most High wasn't even talking to him. He, he was cut off. Why? Because he bowed to the fallen angels, man. You know, for the things that he need, for the things that he knew. This is this is this is real life. You know what I'm talking about. You know. So it makes no sense as to why you would see Noah with the, uh, with the, with the fallen and they was helping him because, it, it, like I said, these, these guys are off that made this, man. You know, the two ball came, the most I wasn't even dealing with him. You see, he, was, he said, why won't you speak to me? The most I cut him off. You know, and, 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 and you see how prideful he was. Like, I take life like you take life. I'm a man like you. There's that he was prideful. So most I wasn't even dealing with him. Remember, no one, remember this, what does it say in the scriptures? Noah was one of the most humblest men, you know? Quiet, submissive, you know? So the most I was, you know, he was dealing with him, but you could see Tubal Cain had a lot of pride, man. That's why the most I was not dealing with him, man. You know? He was cut off, he, you know? So, so that's something also that I took from, um, <laughs> from this movie. So... Why would the Freemasons want to walk in the footsteps of somebody like that? You tell me. So, man, he was cut off, man. The Mossad cut him off. And this is what it shows you in the movie. The Mossad wasn't dealing with him. <laughs> oh, man. But yeah, man, you know, that's about it, man. Hopefully this was edifying. You know, you, you see, you know, a little, little short video. Noah was not a Caucasian man, you know. You know, it's just people that have, like, skin conditions. Like, look at Michael Jackson. That's because his skin color changed. That don't mean he's a white man. Like, his genetics is still black, you know? So, <laughs> people that say that, <laughs> they think that he was a, a Caucasian man. When you read the, when you read the scriptures, that's incorrect, man. He had, he had sons that was black. Like, for example, Ham was the blackest one. They all were black, you know? You know, and it tells you in the scriptures the only, the only person that that could happen to, you know, for where you changed their their, their skin color was, and, and and their kids is gonna come out, you know, white was Gehazi. Because remember, when the Most High put that curse on Gehazi. Remember when he was dealing with Elisha? It was not just Gehazi. It was him and his whole progeny, you know, from that day forth. Him and his whole progeny from that day forth was, you know, was destined to be like that. So we're not going to get too deep into it, man. You know, <laughs> yeah, I mean, because these destinies, I already, I already hit on this already. You know, the, these destinies is a, lot, a little bit controversial, man. You know, but you gotta bring out bring it out sometimes and all praises to the most high man. Hopefully this was edifying.